our final Power Tower Showdown of the year. A race 40 feet in the air for the coveted safety pass, which earns the winner a second chance if they fall at the national finals. And going head to head will be two Coloradans, last year's runner up Austin Gray, and one of the fastest ninjas ever, Jake Murray. Two speed demons squaring off. That's what I'm talking about. If you want it, go get it. Power Tower is going to be nuts. But here's the good news someone from Colorado is going to win it. Two good friends racing for the final safety pass before the national finals. All right, here we go. Get looked at Austin Gray. Austin's all arms. And Jake's using his legs better. And look at that, though, dead even on the rope. Oh, boy, you never know, because when you think about Jake Murray, he's always got some tricks up his sleeve. But Austin Gray first to the salmon ladder. Oh, got a slight lead. But look at Murray coming. Dead even, but Gray a little more efficient. Uh, oh, no, neck and neck. Oh, boy, we've got another showdown, Matt. Oh, what? And you can see, Jack Murray's going sideways. Oh, 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 he's down. down. Oh, wow, the pressure was a lot for Jake Murray. But it's Austin Gray. Yes. <laughs> his biggest fans are celebrating. He's going to take his share your spare message to Las Vegas with his safety pass. And he pushed Jake Murray to go faster than he could, and that speed ended up killing him. These two were neck and neck all the way until the dropping shells. That's where Jake tried a different approach, going sideways and reaching to the next shell. On the second one, he couldn't get a handle and went down. Austin Gray took the traditional approach, Lashang to each one, and it paid off with the buzzer.